Hey, hey, everybody. Me and Cap here. We're batching this morning. We decided to try to catch a perch or two, and it is super hot. So we was looking for someplace breezy and with some shades, so we came to Raymond Gary under the Highway 70 bridge. It's kind of windy under here, which is good for us. It's hot, but I don't know if you could hear us well. We're gonna try to let Cap here catch his lunch. He don't have much of an appetite, so if we just catch a perch or two, that ought to do it. Show him what you got. Hello. Fish a pole. Uh, how about I don't know how we're going to pull this off with me trying to record it on my own and help him fish, but we'll see if we can get it done. I just lost one of our night crawlers. Boy, I got butterfingers. I dropped my minnows and dropped my worms. No, they don't drop the baby, right? Well, he's gone. I'm glad we brought two. No. No, baby, no. Baby, no. Baby, no. He's gone? Yeah. Okay. No. You want to fish? Yeah, I do. All right, sit down there. I'll cast it for you. Why do But. Oh. We're just going to put a little piece of night crawler on it. A little hook and let him cast it out there and reel it in. I don't, I don't know if he can catch one or not. We're about to find out. Sit, sit there. Here you go. I'm gonna get mine rigged up. Hold on just a second, okay? All right, we decided to go with one pole instead of two. It was just a little chaotic with two. The wind's blowing real hard and pushing his bobber. I think it'll just be all around easier working one rod. I don't know if he'll agree with me. Here, Kit, there's one on there. Reel that one in. Here. No, no, on the big pole, bro. Here, let me have the little one. Catch that one. You got it? Reel him in. Oh. Can you reel? Good job. You still got it? Alright, we had to go up to the road and catch us a grasshopper. I bet I was a side up there, a grown man, carrying a baby, chasing grasshoppers on the side of the road. 
I bet it won't be too long before somebody calls the police. There we go. Got us a grasshopper going. Golly, um, hold on, let me retime my line. It must have got pinched in the rocks. All right, we got everything reached back up. When I come, when I come down here, I thought, thought I was gonna have a hard time with it, but I thought it was gonna be because Cat was gonna give me fits. Turns out he's being good as gold. I dropped the bait. Can't seem to get nothing right, huh? What, bud? Cat here, cat here. Uh, Reel that fish in. Uh, Catch him. Catch him. You get him? Uh, Reel him in. Good job. Reel him in. There we go. There we go. Say so they're little babies. 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 I'm gonna put them in the bucket. Well, let's try. Let's try to throw. We got a head left on there. You caught two fish? All right, we're fixing to head back to the house. Perch are not as hard to catch as what we're making it look. Our bait situation's not right, and that's my fault. I only dug up a couple worms before we left the house, and I figured that would be enough. And it would have been had I not dropped one and he got under the rock. We caught a couple little ones, and uh, that'll be enough for him to. That'll be enough for him to eat. No. Okie doke. We got them home, and we're gonna clean them fish. Take them up here to help clean the fish. Where are you going? Do what? I'm gonna pet the dog. Ah. Coming back up, come here. Oh, see Daisy. easy. See the fish you caught? Yeah. And we're just going to cut the bones out because he's going to eat them. Here, put it in the bowl. Put it in the bowl. Good job. Put it in the bowl. Oh. Put it in the bowl. I've done a video the other day on how I clean and flay these perch if you want to see the job done a little closer. The camera footage wasn't perfect. It was kind of blurry. We was in a hurry, but put it in the bowl. But you'll probably be able to see better than you can see this one. All right, we're going to take them in and rinse them up and cook them for his lunch. Boy, come on. Come on, he says. Let me put the pen up. I hope y'all can see me here. I got I got you propped up on the chair. Cat's got his ketchup ready. Just waiting. We're going to take just a little bit of cornmeal because it ain't going to take much. We don't have a whole lot of fish. What are you doing? Then we'll season it with just a little bit of season salt. What? Oh no! Oh, there you go. No. Oh no. Then we'll just mix the season salt in with the cornmeal. Then we'll put his fish in here. Give her a toss. Alright, that's what
what we're gonna end up with right here. I went on put ketchup on it yet. Gotta cook it first. And as soon as that oil gets hot, we're gonna drop it in there and let it fry. Uh. Yeah, it's hot. All right, I think that oil's hot. I'm oh, set it in there. Yeah. Here's what you end up with in little old plays. Start making a flake. All right, there we go. All right, and we got him a little bit of mac and cheese because he loves it. Yeah, you love it. Yes. Oh, the ketchup. I'm just gonna hold these. And put, it, put it on your plate. Is that enough? More? That's enough. And then your fish. It's hot. Okay, it's sizzling, so here. Hold it and let's show them what you got. You got it? So look what I got. Did you catch those fish? Hot, yeah. Alright, we're gonna let them go eat, so until next time, right? <laughs>